bro there is no way it's this what the hell is going on man i wish i had like a single purple when it was you know the tombs of amiskets were at least so i could afford so many things because everything is so dirt cheap right now well ladies and gentlemen today we're gonna do some corner slayer it's been a while and i want to kind of afk some things you know like i got abyssal demons so they're not so much afk but it's okay now my current tasks are abyssal demons in the catacombs of current specifically and i've been thinking what if you combine light bearer plus Din's Bulwark, it has a special attack and it only uses 50% of the special bar and it attracts all the enemies to you. This just must work so good at Necreal. So let me try this 11 by 11 apparently. So wait, does that mean all the way there? Because it, I mean, technically if I use a special attack, right? How does this even work? You use it on one enemy and it hit just one, well, Okay, maybe I was too far. So let's try this again. Okay, the spear is spawned. Let me just hit it like this. Oh my god, Bulwark. Dude, bu oh, it's gonna make so good for like neck rails because they have even more HP than Abyssal Demons. So you will kill them longer as well, a little bit. That also means you'll have more chance for your special bar to recover fully if you're going for the next round. I think it's literally just... Con you no longer have to dart anything anymore. Now, I just got an Abyssal Whip, but... It's weird because I'm 99 Slayer. And I think this is actually my second. Yeah, it's my second Abyssal. I really used to hate doing uh, Abyssal Demon tests. They were not AFK, but they kind of are now. Like you just use Boulevard. By the way, I've been in here for like quite a bit. The Boulevard does work, as you can see. Boom! You just spec like this, AFK. That's it. If I do something like this, how far will it go? It's not so good at this place, is it? I mean, actually, it's not bad. You can tag, like, four of them, and the rest of them... I don't know how people do this. I think they tag with the trident instead of, like, darts, because you have to run really far away. But regardless, I'm not gonna do this task on these, because I can kill the boss variant. And the current KC is just a little bit over 1,000. Now, I'm still actually using Lightbearer just to spec with a BGS. Almost every single time it respawns, I have... Well, spec bar, almost. The thing about it, though, is that you don't have a Berserker ring, and Lightbearer provides absolutely zero stats. There's nothing that it gives, except a double spec regeneration rate. Now, we have over 1,200 KC. You know, the weirdest thing about this, if you go to bosses, or oh, actually, bosses are really not filled up, huh? Like, if you open the other tab, it's like green, green, green. Like, even minigames are a little bit more green. But then, when Nuclear Smoke Devil, I, I still don't have the Occult Necklace. It's 1 in 350. According to Wiki, I even went on uh, Dry Calculation, which is right here, and it says that I had a 90... No, that's a lie. If we do 1,200 instead, uh, I had uh, almost 97% chance, which is not that high, to be honest. It's, it's high, but it's not like 99.5 or something. But yeah, look, when you open the combat achievements, I killed almost 18,000 bosses in total. So how come the collection log is like this? Hmm? Oh, I can't believe it actually has been now almost 10 hours exactly I've been doing Slayer. It just doesn't feel like it. Like, my last Abyssal Demon task, I got four Brimstone Keys, like a couple Ancient Shards, one full Dark Totem. I didn't even extend it with bracelets. So in 10 hours so far, I got 16 Brimstone Keys, which is actually way more than it should have been. I think it's because I selected only those tasks that are like high-level mobs, so I even did like Black Demons, because they had like a decent chance of dropping the keys. You know, but I uh, those uh, abyssal demons done a couple tasks there as well a day will come when i will block worms forever but until then i have to kill them because there's still a harpoon to get which is one in two thousand chance so i'll have to do quite a few tasks however if i try to do this off task it's one in 10k chance so i really gotta do those tasks even if i don't like them even though they're not afk i i just Kind of have to do. They're low HP anyway. It's not that bad. Well, I'm actually very surprised. I've been doing this for what, like 14 hours now? The XP gain is 300k. I'm surprised because I kept the XP rates actually. I think it's because I canceled some of the tasks that were kind of bad XP. Like, if I had to kill like seven Viverns, I just canceled it. I know it's quick, but it's like kind of waste. Smoke Devils again. Well, I'll do that tomorrow. I'm going to sleep now. Look, my trip was about to end. I only had seven Smoke Devils to go. So I wanted to say that, oh, you know, 1,350kc without a single Occult Necklace still. But I got it at the very end. Now that means that I'm only missing a jar. Thermonuclear Smoke Devil. Yep, that is the last item. Four out of five. But it is one in 2,000 chance. And I still don't have 2,000 KC. And this took ages. 1,300. 
takes a long time. You can see 70 KC an hour, but then you have to be on a slay attack, so you can't really like farm it out, you know? Like the current session, I've been killing these guys for like two hours again. So usually one single task takes around two hours and you only get like 150 KC or something. You know, when doing corner, you get weird tasks like kill water fiends in this dungeon as well. I obviously canceled them, but it's, it's so sad. Like no, how many water fiends have been killed in RuneScape? It has to be the least killed slayer creature of all time. He placed a cannon, it is allowed, yes, but it is also not multi in here. So it turns out that regular Hydras are really not that bad at all. Like they do the poison pool thingy, just like the actual alchemical Hydra, but usually you kill it by the time it does it. And if you need anything, you just have blood ammo to fury, it just heals anything else. You just play one player, have a cannon, and it's fully AFK. It's real nice. This Dragon Knight, by the way, 329. That's 600k. Drop. And before that, it was 20 Onyx ball tips. Oh, 62 with a D long? Was that a heal as well? 60, so how do I hit Max? And as the moment that I tried to equip it, it actually hits all of the. All of the hits were high. I'm currently in the original Dust Devil dungeon. This is where you never do Dust Devils at all because other places exist. But if Kona tells you to go to this specific place, I guess that's where you have to go. You can cancel a task though, but it actually has been updated. I thought maybe something was added and there was. There's actually the whole additional area. This is for Slayer only. So in this place you can use a cannon, but it's not multi. So you cannot barrage. But as you enter here, you can see there's multi but you also cannot place a cannon. There's plenty of dust devils walking around this thing. There's like a couple of rooms in here. This one is a little bit too small. There's only five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Oh, this guy's standing so good. Oh, that was beautiful. That's all I had to do. Just cast a special attack once. All right, let's do another one. This is a little bit... Wow, it even reached this one. I want to say they're a little bit spread out, but it didn't get two of them, actually. So I guess you should use a shield, but if there's any remaining ones, I'd still probably want to lure them. I'm not gonna, like, uh, only barrage, like, five of them. So I'm not gonna cherry-pick these clips. These are all in a row. This is how it looks like to lure them. Sometimes you only do, like, four of them at a time, but uh, sometimes I just get unlucky. Like, I aim at something and... The dust devil just walks away and it's like, oh, you only caught like four of them. But most of the time, you get most of them. So this method does work beautifully in this place. Still haven't tried neck reels though. So this is like two and a half days later. The first two days were actually really like popping off. I was getting like a nice, decent amount of keys. But then on the last day, like today... I barely got any, and I did spend like, hold up, how, how much is that, like, uh, seven, eight hours? And I got like three keys, and that's it, I, I had Hydra task and all that, I don't know, I was not getting anything. So for the collection log, this is a very long grind. If it takes like two and a half days to get 41 brimstone keys, and I've done it in the past as well, this should be like 80 chests, or maybe 120 chests already unlocked. It does take long, long time to get these brimstone keys, but also Laran's keys in the wilderness as well because I'm not finished with that. Also, I'm still missing the hat, but I got zero Mystic Dust. The thing is that all of them are 1 in 1,000, so I should probably not expect to get anything. Wait, I just got this one. It wasn't even a unique. And yes, I did unlock the chest almost 120 times right now. Yeah, you see, if I was an Iron Man, I would be looking at loot and be like, oh my god, 211 raw sharks. There's some steel bots. It's going to be amazing. But I'm a main, so all I care about is like the most valuable one, so... I don't know, Snapdragon Seeds, uh, the Dragon Dart tips that I already got on the very first chest and never again, and these, these are uh, very good. Wait, am I spamming the chest? Oh, <laughs> I mean the chat, yes I am. Oh no, this is like one of the places I ideally don't want to go dry as well, so it would be nice to just like, it's about time I get one single piece, you know? If I have to unlock like 2,000 chests like this, oh my god, I'll have to do like so many Slayer tasks in the future, it's not even funny. I actually have to do like 2,000 tasks. It isn't like one task, one key. Probably a little bit more than that, but it, 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 yeah, it's gonna be slow. And it looks like nothing, but at least the chest count has been increased to 158 now. This is already like over one week's worth of Slayer, like right here. Now also I started with a 20 mil junk tab. Now it's currently 25 mil, so I didn't pick up too many valuable items, but if you add this, that's like plus 10 mil, which is 
pretty much gonna pay for my blood amulet of fury shard that I use, like to use. Now I actually couldn't manage to get a necrol task at all, I just got like a bunch of them in the slayer tower, but obviously it's not multi, you can't really test this out, but it seems that both of the rooms are just small enough, and I know that this method is nothing new like Din's Boulevard, but the combination with Lightbearer is a new thing. I think they have enough HP so you could just... Now they had to spread it out a little bit, so you would still have to throw another one, like uh, another dart to lord the, that one. What if I go to this room, let's say if I do in the middle right here. Yeah, yeah, the necro should be extremely good, it's just that Kona doesn't really give them that much. Alright guys, that's gonna be all, I'm, I'm going to bed now, it's so late. Bye-bye. <laughs>